Are you wondering how to assess the performance of your salesman? In case you may consider ranking your salesman based on your sales volume. Hence, you can create a leaderboard and get a clear picture of your employee's performance. Hello everyone, welcome to Excel Demi, your day-to-day -day Excel and Vivio tutorial helpline. This is Hadiun Basher and today I'll demonstrate how to create a leaderboard in Excel. I'll use Microsoft Excel 365. Let's get introduced to our dataset. We have a sales dataset that includes salesman and their corresponding sales amount. Now, to spot the top salesman, I'll create a leaderboard of these salesmen on the basis of their sales figures. For this reason, first of all, I need to create a serial number starting from 1 for all the salesmen. Here, I'll rank the salesman in column B, so I'll also use this column B to assign the initial serial number for this salesman. You can insert the serial numbers starting from 1 and assign a chronological initial serial number for all the salesmen. However, you can also use the row function to create the serial number. For that reason, to get the initial serial number of the first employee, go to cell B5, type equal, row. The row function returns the row number of your specified cell. Press tab to autocomplete the row function. As a reference argument of the row function, you can insert a cell reference. Alternatively, you can leave this reference argument of the row function as blank. In that case, the row function will return the row number of the currently active cell. So, if I close the parenthesis of the row function and hit enter as cell B5 is the currently active cell, so the row function will return 5. Now hit enter as expected. You can see the row function has returned 5. However, I want to start the serial number from 1, so I'll subtract 4. Therefore, go to the formula bar and insert minus 4. Now hit enter, and this returns 1 in the cell B5. One thing I should mention here that this is the temporary serial number and it is not based on the sales figure. I have inserted this temporary serial number to get the final rank. Now let me use the autofill feature to assign a serial number for all the salesmen. As a result, all the salesmen are assigned a unique initial serial number. Now, I'll apply the sort feature to create the leaderboard based on the sales amount. For that reason, select the entire dataset from cell B5 to D13, then move to the data tab. In the sort and filter section, choose the option sort. This opens the sort window. Here you will find the available options based on which your dataset will be sorted. And as my dataset has headers, so the checked my data has headers option is perfect for my case. Now, I'll set the condition based on which my data set will be sorted. From the column section in the sort by field, you can click on this drop down icon and here you will find the available options based on which your data set will be sorted. In this case, I'll sort this data set by the sales amount. So, I'll choose the option sales amount and the data set will be sorted based on the sale values. Then, you can set the order. The default setting is the smallest to largest. You can click on this drop down icon to get all the options. You can see the largest to smallest option here. Also, if you want to define a custom order, then you can choose the custom list option. Now, as I want to place the salesman with the highest sales amount at the top of this list, so from the available options, I'll choose the option largest to smallest to sort my data set on a descending order. Now click on OK to apply the sorting. 
as a result you can see that the data set is sorted accordingly here all the salesmen are ranked based on their sales amount the salesman with the highest sales amount that is 7000 in this case is ranked as one on the other hand the salesman sophia with the lowest sales amount 2700 is ranked as number nine and the salesman with the sales amount in between are ranked accordingly in this way you can create a leaderboard and spot your top performers i have demonstrated the step-by-step -step guide for creating a leaderboard in excel hopefully you can apply this knowledge according to your requirements and convenience you can download the practice workbook from the video description to sharpen your excel skills feel free to leave any questions suggestions or feedback in the comment section below you can go to exceldemy.com to read our excel blogs or you can share your excel related issues in our exceldemy forum and receive free solutions for more content like this make sure to subscribe to our channel thanks for watching our video bye